<laughs> till, till the 90s, cars were basically mechanics. And there were wheels, you know, <laughs> clutches. All this is coming from our industry. It's coming from the watch industry. So we have a direct link from uh, the uh, technical point of view, but also from the, you know, when you look at the watch, it looks like an engine. Uh, and this is probably the reason why a lot of people who love cars, love watches, and reverse, a lot of people who love watches, love cars. We are linked to automobile, we are linked to Formula One, <laughs> uh, we are linked uh, 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 to, to Monaco as a watch. Let's become partner of the Monaco uh, Museum. We always should have one leg into the future. That's the only way to walk. You can only walk if one of your two legs goes to the future, <laughs> uh, goes forward. But the other one must stay where it is, if not you fall. So to have two legs is the best way to move. When I read all the newspapers, when I read what the Germans have decided for diesel, when I read what Paris wants, they want the no cars in 2025, 20, when I read what China wants to do, I say to myself, God damn, in, in 15 years or 20 years, the future will certainly not be uh, the diesel or, or, or the petrol one, uh, car. So I think there's a lot of future in, in the Formula E. going to grow more and more with more manufacturers coming on board now with this new car.